Why, hello there. Welcome to Legend of Dungeon. Last time I played this, I did awful and died. But this time, it's going to be totally wizard. If we can just... Yep, cool. You know, half the time when you, you try to pull this off, you end up high-fiving someone else, and then you end up playing as a class that you really, really hate, like the ones that shoot their gold everywhere and are otherwise useless, like the cowboy. Just to make a quick change, and we'll, we'll get going. You'll notice that I, I didn't even mention being ashamed of that pun, and that's because I'm not. I was very pleased with it, in fact. Hello! Where did this come from? Ah! I wasted... One of my things. Is, is this even good? No. Looks like it's it's useless. Whoa, hello. There we go. Uh, if I remember rightly. Yep. So I'm gonna play as the wizard because they're easy. Like I said last time, I managed to get myself killed on level two, which was uh, super good considering that I usually do much better. But who, who's complaining? Who's complaining? Certainly not you. Did you did you watch that? It's embarrassing. I was talking about how well I was doing and then immediately got killed. Oh, my wizard bolts. They don't go where I want them to. Eh. I can't use my spells while I'm stuck on the stairs. Taste of my furious magics. We're not going back up there. Okay, so what was that? That was blood red. Blood red is good. That's bad. I, I do hate the fact that they don't remind me of what... Ooh. They don't remind me of what the potions do later. It's plus one. That's not as good as these, these bunny ears. Crap. Stay away from me. <laughs> I'm so good at the game, you you can already tell. Yeah, they don't remind you what the potions do. First time they're unidentified, but, you know, most games have been nice enough when they do the, hey, randomly generated, true roguelike action going on with these. Can I use that? Oh, I can, sweet. When they go the true roguelike route, um... Hello? I'm pretty sure I bound one of these buttons to get rid of... Whatever. Ah! Stay away from me! Apparently I don't have a drop item button anymore, which is a pain. Yeah, let's go upstairs anyway. You never know, you, you might be okay. Yes! Good. Completely just knock my healing items into the slimes. Like a pro. Yeah, the benefit with the wizard is that they start off with a ranged attack that is not entirely dependent on your ability to... ...shoot at other things using a limited resource like gold. Which is why I hate the cowboy. Oh. So they've got the range, they've got the reach, and you don't have to worry about getting yourself killed being stupid. It's win win win. What'd that do? Nothing. Uh, the knight's crazy easy because they've got a lot of health, but also there's the, the, the fun fact that. Well, that was terrible. The fun fact that when they level up, they don't gain their health and fall, so you're constantly healing them and wasting the limited number of healing items you have just to maintain them at their base level. <sighs> Buggerations. See, I'm off to a flying start. Get out of here. Okay, that's off opening something. Oh my god, I can climb these stairs and get nothing. Yeah. Feel good about that. So 
yes, welcome to Legend of Dungeon. I've kicked it off to a flying start. We will hopefully beat this game today at some point. Ugh. And that's why I hate melee in this game. It's, it's just, it's a battle of attrition. Gotta have that wizard power. How did I miss those stairs before? Grunt! Oh, there's a, there's a boss already. Lovely. Here we go. Get off as many of these as possible before we can get accosted by something else. I mean, they do ultimately seek people out. They're magic missiles. So the idea is to just fill a room with them and hope that anything that tries to come through here is, is going to eventually get hit by them. And that one got set on fire, so... Fantastic. The only real problem I foresee is the fact that if it kills something weak, I might have some troubles with, um... getting the experience orbs, which decay if you leave them alone on the floor. There, my own magic is setting me on fire. We're off to a fantastic start. You can do zero damage to the vampire until he turns into those bats. Oh my god! Why did my own magic also set me on fire? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This is just, like, the worst. <laughs> wow. Which, I'm, I'm off to such a flying start. Well, that did something good. I don't know why. It's hard to tell. It's part of the magic of the game. How you doing? I'm already out of commentary. I'm good. <laughs> I can't believe it. I, I swear I, I had like thoughts earlier about like clever things to say. None of them spring to mind at this, this very moment. And I just wasted all my healing on on that. It's it's so scarce in this. I'm sincerely hoping that this was another passageway which I've accidentally stumbled into because, yeah, I just picked up a book I can't wow. use. Whew. Gotcha, got you. Yeah, we're not actually doing too bad here. I might kill this vampire. Don't, don't come through that narrow gap. I'm just gonna fill this with magic. You stay out of there. That's right, you fly out of that big room. You don't come down here. Don't come down here! I don't need you swarming me, you son of a... Un... Dead and unholy union of dark magics and such. Okay. So if that door leads in there, then I know that this other door... This one leads to the other side, so we'll just look. He can, he can go in there. He can go in there. I'll just I'll just chill out over here. Is there another door that I can escape out of? No. Good. Wow. Less bats for you, buddy boy. Wow. Ugh, and now there's another monster in here to deal with. No! Don't kill me. I haven't gone very far. Whoo! Two boss victories on a single run? My god, if I got, like, items that were useful out of that. Just imagine how well we'd be doing. Oh my god! Such apples. You gotta love it. Oh! Yeah, I, sh I should be careful not to accidentally kill those. Because you can, and it's bad. Um, 
Oh god, was this you good? Let's drink it. Nope! Great. Don't need that. Aha! I can throw shit away. Well, that's... That's wonderful. Yeah, why not? Yay! Lime green is also good. Useful to know. Okay, I believe that leaves us with one door that I haven't gone through. Those statues can't come to life and kill you. Die. So it's, it's always good to simply cast a whole bunch of bolts around them and see if one of them does eventually actively target them. See, I am wise in the ways of, of this thing. I'm hoping to get more than two episodes out of this and, like, one of those episodes not be the- Oh my god, another vampire. See, if I was not the wizard, this would be so much harder to deal with that many vampires. I'd just run away. Not this time. Not this time. We've got a door we can retreat down. Yeah, we just basically want to fill this place with as much magic as possible. So if he does turn into a bat, uh, he, he can his bats will be consumed in the, the fire of magic, which I'm filling the room with. No, bad. Go away. It helps to be in a place where, where he cannot just swarm around you and you're screwed because it consume your health in a matter of seconds. Go away. Ah, we'll deal with him. There's a dog. Somebody must be here. How exciting. Shush you! It's usually nobody, so... I generally tell her to shush up. How long has this been? Probably long enough. I think that we'll call it here. Uh, hopefully, more to come. And... By more to come, I mean, like, not just a few seconds of it before inevitably accidentally killing myself. We shall see. Until next time, look forward to it.